Hey guys, welcome back, it's Kangi here, and today I'm bringing you another tutorial on Minecraft servers, and bucket servers. Um, today I will be showing you a more brief description that a lot of people can't really seem to be able to describe of how like the whole dot .bat file works and starting your jar, like your dot .jar files for like say bucket, tech it, and just your vanilla Minecraft and all that sort of thing. So your vanilla minecraft um, jar, I'll post download links in the description, I know they all work, I've tested them on all my own servers. These work without any editing needed, so they, all you do is just put in the same folder as um, your minecraft server, double click it, and it'll actually come up, like mine just runs away. Or well, then when it comes to bucket, this is where a lot of the issues start coming into play since you actually have to edit what it says in the bucket um, dot bat file. So with your first, I know this one, this I'll post the link in the description for this one too. This is the only one I'll do that's like edited. Um, this is for the Minecraft 1.6.2 recommended build, so it's not its beta or its development build. So this will work straight away. And see, this is what you need to change. This is what you copy and paste directly from the .jar file that you download from Bucket itself. So most of the times they'll be just right. Usually here it'll just be called Craft Bucket, like I'll show you here. So this one's just called Straight Craft Bucket. So what you need to do is go over to this one. So this is the one you'll download and it'll say craftbucket.jar. You need to go to your jar file, um, bring, go down the bottom and click for um, rename. And then when you go to your bucket starter ones, change this craft bucket here, nothing else. This is craft bucket. Change it to whatever was in that bottom dot jar. Or you can change what's in the dot jar to just straight craft bucket and they'll work instantly. Um, a lot of the times um, people just go into the bucket website, copy this and then go put in their thing and it will say some error message that it can't run or something or can't find the Java code or something like that. Um, the reason why is because or if you, you, can, you see it in fine print on the actual bucket website that it will say to change it to the name of the bucket server, um, bucket.jar server name. So this one will work for its recommended build, so it's recommended number one. And it's 1.6.2 so this will work straight away and this one one needs editing unless you change it on the dodge r file so hopefully that explains everything to you guys um, it's a pretty brief description and all that not much to explain um, so the vanilla one works without any editing buck Bucket works, but you have to edit it unless you're using the 1.6.2 recommended build. Download links in the um, will be all in the description for these. They do use Ad AdFly just so um, I don't get people like downloading heaps of them and all that for no reason. And and all and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, thanks for watching. If you need any help or anything, just comment and I will reply within a day or two or just send me an email or something and I should be able to help you guys out. Alright, thanks guys. See ya.